Forget the new Star Wars trailer. That movie doesn't open for over a year. The Force awakened in Oklahoma City on Friday night as Russell Westbrook returned to the starting lineup and in the first eight minutes and 27 seconds of the game, he scored or assisted on 10 of 11 Thunder field goals. For the first time in his career, he scored 20 points and had five or more assists in the first half. And though he played sparingly in the second half, sitting the entire fourth quarter, Westbrook finished with 32 points, eight assists and seven rebounds and hit 12 of 17 shots, three of four from deep. His only miss, a long heave as the shot clock expired, as Knicks coach Derek Fisher was probably left wishing he had never left Oklahoma City as the Thunder gets the 105-78 victory over the New York Knicks. Uh, I just try to go out and, uh, you know, find a way to help my team. Um, you know, we got to play with a sense of urgency every night. And tonight was, uh, you know, against a, a team that needed to win just like us. And uh, we came out and uh, we hit them first. The great ones make their teammates better. And Russell is a, is a great player. He really, his determination and his ability to impact winning uh, is reflected on what he throws out there every night. He throws great effort. And he, 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 he plays with uh, a force and an energy and a determination that's hard to contain. You, have to, you always have to know where he is on, on the floor. Uh, and he, 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 makes, he, makes the, he makes the right decisions. You know, he can score and he can make plays for others. And that's what, he, that's what he does. And that's what he has to continue to do. And he's been doing it for a long time now. Just go and you know, hope they follow. Uh, my job as a point guard is to be able to come in every game, bring the energy, uh, competitive spirit, and uh, hope my teammates follow, man. That's, that's a part of my job, and that's what I try to do for this team. First of all, I think we were all excited to have him back, so it gave us a little bit of a boost, but it's the way he plays. Um, like I was saying, he's pushing the ball, and you ha everyone keeps up with him, and, and the whole team plays at a, at, at a higher pace. And when he's uh, coming off making decisions, finding guys like that, uh, we're tough to beat, so it's great to have him back, and, and now we got to work on work on all our stuff and, and figuring out how we're going to play with him. Uh, yeah, when he starts off playing that well, it's always, you know, we got a pep in our step. I think we were just excited to have him back, just as the fans, and um, the place was electrified. So he brought a spark by coming back. I think we'd have been amped regardless, but especially when he was playing well, it was hard not to be happy. Yeah. So he did great for us tonight. Happy. Hopefully he can continue with the success and hopefully our team can continue to you know, thrive and play well. We're just trying to get as many wins as possible. So the Thunder never trails and shoots 44% from the field, 42% from three, and out rebounds the Knicks by 24, 57 to 33. If this was a trailer for the Thunder season, count me in. Next up, the Thunder must hit the road and plays at a pretty good Pelicans team, a winless 76ers team, a bad Detroit Pistons team, and then returns home to host a, a decent Milwaukee Bucks team. At that point, there may be another plot twist, perhaps the return of Kevin Durant. We shall see. Reporting from Chesapeake Energy Arena, Damon Fontenot, News OK Sports.